According to Dan Brown's Da Vinci Code Magdalene Mary, who was never mentioned as a prostitute in the Bible or who was never mentioned in any of the relations with Jesus in the Bible, both testaments, was leaning on the shoulders of Jesus was a false claim. Though da Vinci was a 15th century poet, he made the painting of Last Supper considering the ancient persons and civilizations who were very strict in their respective cultures. Da Vinci depicted the painting as Mary Magdalene leaning on the shoulder of Jesus was ideally just and has no criticisms. What Dan Brown the author of The Da Vinci Code made she was leaning on Jesus' shoulders which is an unjust claim back in 2000 years ago. Back in 2000 years, a woman touching a man or even seeing into his eyes was considered a sin and even some led to harsh punishments in the Middle Asian and European kingdoms. If Mary Magdalene had leaned her head on Jesus' shoulders in an extramarital relationship then she would have been on the cross before Jesus. Did that happen? The answer was a clear no. What Jesus did was he helped her, he touched her, and during the Last Supper he even called her to the supper. When everyone blamed Jesus for calling Mary Magdalene to the supper, Jesus even drank the wine in a chalice which was used by Mary Magdalene. Then she came near Jesus and leaned her head on Jesus' shoulders which was a grateful feeling to her Jesus. At this moment Jesus the man or a messenger of God or a mediator between humans and God turned into God. Later she took the chalice from Jesus and preserved it till her last breath. And then it got lost in time memories. A woman holding or carrying chalice in those times was a sin, considering a woman as a perpetrator. From then onwards the symbol of chalice in two-dimensional is represented as the symbol of feminism or female depicting for every female Jesus as the protector. Females should take charge in every aspect of life. Jesus gave Mary Magdalene the chalice, not the bloodline which is a baseless claim. The bloodline claim was popularized by anti-Roman Catholic followers because Roman Catholics profoundly followed Mary Magdalene and were in no relationship with Jesus. And this is what da Vinci wanted to show the world through his Last Supper painting. If Jesus married or in relation with Mary Magdalene, Mary was the first person to be chopped her head off. The truth is buried.